and welcome to the first episode of the year for the Redskin Roundup. I'm one of your hosts, Morgan Lemke. And I'm Todd Thomas. Thanks for joining us. It's been a great start to this school year, and we'll be sharing some fun features every Friday. So let's get started with our first segment. This Week in History, here's Austin Lees. On September 8, 1996, rapper Tupac Shakur was shot in a drive-by shooting in Las Vegas. After attending a boxing match, he died from his injuries several days later. Back to you. Thanks, Austin. In other news, we'll, we have several new faces here at Port Klein High School, and we'll be sharing a new one each week. This week, it's science teacher Mr. Weekman. He's in his 21st year of teaching. He's the head boys cross country and girls softball coach, and he's married to another science teacher, Ms. Mrs. Weekman. And they have three daughters that go here at Port Clinton schools. In his spare time, he likes to hunt and garden. Welcome, Mr. Weekman. We're happy to have you join our Port Clinton family. It's time now for our quote of the week. Joining us in the studio is Dawson Scott with this week's quote. This week's quote of the week is, Sometimes we're tested, not to show our weaknesses, but to discover our strengths. Back to you. Very uplifting quote. Thanks, Dawson. Next up is our newest feature, Fact or Fake. In this segment, we'll be sharing two truths and a lie. It's your job to figure out which one's a lie. Here's Indica Bono. Can you guess which of these facts are fake? The average cloud weighs over a million pounds, bananas go on trees, or giraffes and humans have the same collarbones. And the fake is, bananas grow on trees. They actually grow on massive herbs. Back to you. Did you know the lie? No, I didn't. Well, that's okay, because we'll feature another fact or fake on our next episode. And to wrap things up, let's go to Eva Clementoff with this week's news recap. Your book pickup will be next Monday and Tuesday during lunch. If you didn't buy one and would like one, there will be a limited number for sale for $70. In sports news, open fields for softball start Monday and will run Mondays and Wednesdays from 3.30 to 5. Questions? See Coach Weekman in room 215. Pre-sale tickets for a night's home football game are on sale in the main office until 2.45 p.m. for $5. All tickets at the gate will be $7. And finally, best of luck to the football team in their game versus Toledo Bowsher tonight at home. And on Saturday, the cross-country teams run in the Tiffin Carnival, the volleyball team heads to Fostoria, and the girls' soccer team takes on Mansfield Senior. Good luck, sports teams. Back to you in the studio. Well, that wraps it up for this week's Redskin Roundup. We'll be back next Friday with more fun features. Have a great weekend, everyone. <laughs>